Alright folks, I'm checking in Stormtopia.com and Stormtopia.com Facebook page. I'm video weather update right now. Our hurricane forecast was released yesterday. Hopefully you got a chance to see it. If not, that's okay. It has now been replaced. Uh, it has now replaced the hurricane forecast type of video in our left sidebar, sidebar portion of our website. So you can watch it there if you didn't get a chance. It's long, but very, very useful. So, let's take a look at what's going to occur now. Easter Sunday, tomorrow, I believe. Looks like the rain should be gone by the time, um, mo most of the, by, the t by morning time, because it's, uh, the forecast, uh, the speed of the rain has accelerated a little bit. That I've been talking about for days now. Here you see a little bit of snow on the back end coming back through central Wisconsin, but nothing major. So what's happening is there's a pretty m decent moderate to heavy burst of rain, but they're really interspersed. You see across southwest Pennsylvania, there's a little bit of break. That's just moving out of West Virginia. And then once you get around the cyclonic, uh, where the most of the site, where the most of the low pressure center is, it's really interspersed stuff across the Ohio Valley. And that's what's going to be here for the morning. This is what we're going to be dealing with tonight and this afternoon for much of the East Coast. So let's take a look at the model guidance right now start you off with the NAM and that's probably the only model I'm going to need to show you since this event is pretty well agreed on and then here we are by this evening and you see it's pushing through and the heaviest uh, this is actually the blue stuff you see is very heavy rain but that's interspersed across uh, Albany down towards the Dalmarva and meanwhile rain is pushing through southern New England as we go through the nighttime hours <coughs> our high should top out in the 40s for much of southern New England, 50s further south, and then you get into Sunday, and the rain's pushing through, pushing through, but by mid-morning, it's definitely all gone, and by early morning, it's gone for the east coast, just southern New England, it takes an additional couple hours to clear out, because southern New England is further east. So that's how that ends up working, I believe. Monday, Tuesday, two great-looking days, and then our uh, pattern becomes amped and active once again as we make our way into midweek next week. So stay tuned for details on that. Again, folks, hurricane forecast is available in the left sidebar portion of our website. Enjoy your day.